If you are celebrating Thanksgiving this weekend and looking for something delicious to add to your table, we have found it, and it's from Jason Scrobar. So you know that it's really good. Jason, here, it's here with a feast. I am. I won't tell everybody how you describe the feast because okay, there was yeah. an expletive involved, but it was very worth it that's, because this looks amazing. That's for the after hour show, <laughs> if, if there is one. Um, we're gonna, an after hours Jason Scrobar. Well, not segment? just Jason Scrobar, no, an after hours your morning show. <laughs> That would be afternoon. Right, anyway, right, right. Okay, yeah. <laughs> let's start with dessert. We're going to do it a little backwards. We're starting with dessert because you know you technically want to make the dessert, put it in the oven, and let it have it cool, sitting on the on the countertop. You know, while you make your uh, the rest of your feast. So we're doing the easiest dessert you'll ever ever do. Okay. It's a chocolate and pecan galette. So I've already that doesn't sound easy. It, well, I know, but it is. I was okay. making the one that we're going to eat later last night, and I was like, this took me no time. So okay. I've rolled out store bought um, puff pastry. Okay. Okay. Put it on to a parchment lined baking sheet. So now in the bowl, I'm gonna make the filling. Pecans, okay. chocolate. Now- You've done a few different kinds of chocolate in here. Yeah, because you can use whatever you want. You, if you have um, dark chocolate, if you have chocolate chips, if you, you have that. milk chocolate, You've you can use chips whatever and you want. In there. Um, there's some brown sugar in Ooh, there. Chocolate and brown sugar, And then yes. some melted butter. That goes in, okay. and then a uh, an egg to bind everything together. A little bit of maple syrup goes in, oh. and then I'm gonna. And get then we you... just eat this. Well, no. yeah, we could. I mean, the, the raw egg might not be yeah, good. Yeah, you're right. But, um, and then we just basically mix that up until it's all combined. Oh my gosh! And then look how easy this. You just glossy pour and good. this onto the center of your tart. Okay. You like basically Can I move do that it around. For you? Yeah. Am I going right to the edge, or am I leaving some space? Leave a little bit of space because while you do that, I'm gonna start putting this together, because look at all you do is take Fold this, it up. and you can be as messy as you want. If, do you want to try the other side? Sure. So I'm then, gonna reach across, I don't want to get that on your tattoos. Like okay. that, <laughs> like that, like that. That's as easy as it is. You brush it with some, oh, look at that. You brush it with some egg wash, yep. and then you take some demerara sugar, and you oh, just pretty. do that. You throw this in the oven and it's ready to go. 30 minutes is all it takes. And then this is it. Can I and try it this And this is what you get, this beautiful tart look. like that. Oh, look, look at that. that on the inside. Can I show them? Yes. Oh, look at this. Look at that. Look Easy peasy, but we still oh, have so a few good. other things. So this is one of my favorite sides to make. A smashed, oh, no, no, no. how is it? <laughs> it's like the best chocolate chip cookie I've ever had. There you go. Maybe that's what I'll rename it. Mm, control room is, oh, you guys. This is so good. Right? Okay, but we have more. We have more. So this is my easy um, smashed potato salad. So these just came out of the oven, so they're still a little bit warm. You can kind of do this, customize it. We're adding a little bit of uh, green onions to this, Hi. some bacon, because kind of bacon's kind of fun with potatoes, some parsley. I like um, capers to add a little bit of saltiness. Oh, now, yes. Look how beautiful that is. This dressing is like a five or six ingredients. You pour that over top, right at the table. You mix it up, maybe add a little bit more parsley mm -hmm. and bring that to your table and who wouldn't be impressed with that? Okay, can I try some of this? And we haven't, yes, try that. We haven't even gotten to the main, the, the yeah. star of the show. So mm. this is a... Hang on, what's in that oh, dressing? Wait. Oh yeah, so we've got Dijon mustard, mm -hmm. we have maple syrup, we have olive oil, a little bit of salt and pepper, a little bit of maple syrup, easy peasy. Mm. And the capers are a nice zinc. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So while you continue to dive into this, we'll talk about this. So oh you gosh. don't want to do a full turkey. So mm -hmm. if it's just you and your partner or just you and a few other people and you want to do something a bit smaller, mm -hmm. you can take a turkey breast that's already been deboned and butterfly. So that just means flatten it out. Okay. Um, and then I've um, stuffed it with like a winter green stuffing. So there's kale, oh. there's collard greens, there's mm. dandelion green spinach. All of that stuff gets wilted down with um, ricotta and Parmesan cheese. You roll it and you throw it in the oven and look how beautiful that is. Okay, can I can do some of this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, where's, there's no knife, is there a knife? There's a knife there. Yeah. While you eat that, I feel like we're doing like gymnastics here because yeah. I want to get to the- um, Food gymnastics, look at this. now that so should these, be an Olympic sport should be your next biscuit for your holiday dinner. This is a super simple, all these things are really super simple. Oh, that's really good. Sweet potato. Oh, no, no for Attila. Hang on, oh, look. pause, there you go. <laughs> look at that. Sweet potato, Sweet potato. Um, biscuits. Simple, that, they're really easy to make. Okay. I feel like I'm gonna dive into this while you dive into that. And then again, so we, f we finished the meal, we started it today with it, but yeah. the uh, chocolate pecan, What's in this? Uh, sweet, sweet potato biscuit. So it's bu a buttermilk, sweet potato. There's like four or five other ingredients. And do you flour. serve this instead of like a bun? Yeah. 
This is your bread. Oh, can you imagine these? Warm out of the oven. Right? Get some salted butter. I feel like we should just sit down and have like a proper meal. I'm thankful for you. Oh, I'm thankful mm. for you. Mm. Thankful for you guys. I'm also thankful for this. This is like the best chocolate chip cookie I've ever eaten. I am seriously going to rename the recipe that. Oh, good. Anne Are you going to call it Anne Marie's? Yes. Best chocolate chip cookie yes. ever? Yes. I am. You made my day. I'm going to stuff my mouth full of this. Jason Scrobar, thank you so much. All of these ideas were so great for the weekend and so easy. Easy. Easy peasy. We're going to keep diving in. Okay. If you liked that video, make sure to subscribe to the Your Morning YouTube feed where you can find all kinds of new content posted every weekday morning.